Megan from Angel Body Jewelry here. So today I'm going to be taking you through your basic steps for how to expand your earlobes. So when we're starting from a piercing, your fresh piercing has to be healed for at least six to eight weeks before any stretching can start. So always consult your piercer beforehand if you're not too sure, get them to give you an overall idea of how your piercings are all healed up, how they're looking. If we've got the all good, then we're good to stretch up. So originally when you start, you use what's called a taper. So that's these little pieces here. Thin on one end goes to your thicker at the top. Your desired size is going to be this thickest part here. Also comes with your two O-rings. So the way to expand your ears is always recommended to be done after a nice warm shower. So you have the blood circulating so it's nice and fresh. So there's not going to be any chance of any tearing or any pressure put on the ears. Always use lubricant. Got to use it quite a lot. You know, never have too much of it, especially with stretching the ear. You don't want anything to be able to grab. That way it can cause any little tears and it can cause a lot of irritations with the lobe. What we have at our store is what we recommend is the gauge gear. So this one here is 100% organic stretching balm that we stock in our store. It's really wonderful, full of natural ingredients and it's really good for giving you that nice soft lubricant to help you get a nice smooth stretch with your ears. So, when we're starting, also got to keep in mind as well, the first time that you put the taper in, it may not go the whole way in the first time you're trying to pop it in your ears. So hence why we have our little O-rings. So, take your taper like this, you've got it on the front of the ear, you're going to apply it nice, even pressure. You're going to be pushing it through. You'll feel it naturally stop. There shouldn't be any pain. There may be some slight discomfort. Once you start to stop to feel that discomfort and it's held snugly in place, move your O-rings to either side and keep it in place. Give it a nice rest for it. Essentially the next day, what we want to do, hot shower again, more lubricant, and then we're going to ease the taper the rest of the way through to have it sat and settled in the ear. Once your taper is in, you've got to give it at least four to five days between sizes. The bigger you want your ears to go, the longer you need to leave your wait time as well because there's a bit more pressure that's been put on the ear. You want to make sure that it's nice and healed and it's not too angry, nothing's going on up there before we go up to your next size. With your stretching as well, just keeping in mind there is a point of no return. So once you hit your sort of eight millimeter to 10 millimeter mark, once you go through there, your ear may not be able to return to its original size. You just need to treat your ears like an elastic band almost, just thinking the more that you stretch it, the less chance the elasticity is still there and it's gonna be able to go back down again. So stretching your ears is a really big commitment, especially if you wanna have something that's gonna be quite large like my ears, just keeping in mind that once they're like this, they're gonna be staying like this. Keeping your ears nice and moisturized as well and your overall ear health is another really important step too making sure that you've got the proper materials for your ears. Stretching with the surgical steel tapers is always recommended. We do also stock them in an acrylic and we also have them in organics as well. You'll always get your smoothest stretch if you're using your surgical steel tapers, nice and comfortable. Biggest thing I guess to remember is once you're healed and you're at your goal size, you can't be wearing your tapers as jewelry all the time. That's not what they're designed for. So once your ear is healed and you've got your tapers out, you can always come down to see us here at Angel Body Jewelry. We've got a huge range of plugs and tunnels and then we can help you out getting something that's going to be suitable for everyday wear. Thank you.